Okay guys, it's Tech Zero Stickies Glue and I'm going to show you how to flash a ROM onto your rooted HTC Hero. So I'm currently running the Modarco um, version 1, which is nice and quick, but I want to update to his new enhanced version, which has a couple of extra features to there. So the first thing you want to do is go to this link here in the sidebar and choose the download. You can either download the core or the enhanced. I'm going to go for the enhanced. So you just click this and it'll download. As you can see that's downloading and I have 20, no 16 minutes left. So I'm just going to cut because otherwise I'm going to be able to fit this video in and you'll all get very bored. Okay guys, so I'm back. As you can see, it's downloaded. So, you want to go into your download folder. Uh, where's mine? Um, okay. And you want to find your f download. Okay. So, I've downloaded the 2.1 update and whichever one you downloaded, the enhanced or normal, you want to rename it to simply update. Oh dear, I've got the old one still. Let's delete that. Okay. So, you want to rename it to and that's where I went wrong for a while because there wasn't really any and all the guys that didn't really tell you to do that and I was getting really confused and nothing was working um, so I eventually figured it out so you want to do that and then you want to go to your hero and mount it okay Open up the folder view, delete the old update file, and you want to. I should say you shouldn't have to delete that update, that's only there because I've already flashed the previous one. Drop it straight onto your SD card, not in a folder, it has to be straight on the root of the SD card. And that's copying here. So, we're on our way, guys. Let's go in. it's updated well it's downloaded not updated yet okay so when you've done that you want to unmount and you want to unplug I suggest I highly recommend that is that you plug your hero into the mains like so, which was done smoothly and quickly. So you plug it into your mains because you really don't want this thing to run out of juice while it's flashing and brick itself as you've spent a decent amount of money on this. So you've done that. Now what you want to do is power down. And if you haven't already, I should have said this at the start really, if you haven't already got the um, boot image um, installed, there's a vid here on how to do that because you need that. You now power up into that bootloader using the home key and power buttons. Like so, okay. And the first thing you want to do is an Android version 2.2 backup. You can see that backup just, to, just in case anything does go wrong. And I'm just going to cut the video again. Okay, so as you can see the backup is complete and you now want to go back to the menu and choose the second one down, apply SD card, update.zip, hit that, hit home to confirm it and you're flashing. So for the third time, I'll be back in a sec when it's actually done. 
Okay guys, so as you can see the install from SD has completed, your um, flash is done, and you want to go on the top option, reboot system now, and you should have a newly ROM flashed HTC Hero. So, while this loads, I'm just going to take a quick minute to say I think thanks guys for all the ratings and comments and views. But I haven't actually got that many subscribers, or maybe I think I should have more, but I haven't got that many. So I urge you, please subscribe. If you don't, loads of kittens will die. No, only joking, but please guys, if you like these videos, please do subscribe, because it's really helpful. It sort of gives me more motivation to do these. And in the end, hopefully these do help you. So that's a quick note. As you can see, we're booting up. This is hurting my arm. I need a tripod. <laughs> oh, you may or may not have noticed in that boot. For some reason, there's no sound, which is a shame. Um, Mode Arco's not got any sound in it, which a lot of people have complained about deeply, saying they no longer have a reason to live. As there's no sound, would you please put the sound on the next update, or they're not going to download his ROM? Which I think is a bit extreme, personally. I mean, the update noise might be quite nice, but it's kind of unnecessary. As you can tell, I'm waffling. This is probably going to be over 10 minutes now, isn't it? Here we go. So, here's the return of the fuzzy dude. Okay, as you can see, this saved all my settings, like lock screen, wallpaper, all the apps will be here. I believe that's because I've updated, not flashed a completely new ROM. I may be wrong, maybe Modoco's written this into it since I flashed his first one. But when I flashed the first one, it did completely poof all the apps. I had to re download those. Did I just say poof all the apps? What the hell? Anyway, so as you can see, it's a bit laggy when you first start, seeing as you just flashed it. Already got a text message. God, I'm popular. Okay, so, hmm, yeah, seems quick still. Let's look at those extra apps supposed to be installed on the bottom, I think. Here we go. WAP browser, that's quite nice. And then this, but I did already have that from a crack, so I think it's done, just left it. I suppose it's quite nice. See, it doesn't seem to be any slower, which is good. Oh, see if Google Mail works. My Google Mail's broken. No, still no connection. Maybe Wi Fi's not turned on. No, Wi Fi is on. Is it working? Who knows? Oh, well, that's for another video. So, as you can see, that's how you flash a ROM. I hope that's helped you guys. And this is Texo Sickies Glee. See you guys later.